hello students hello i am asmi misra your mathematics teacher and i am going to teach you a very interesting facts of mathematics now let us see there is a typical problem uh, the students are suffering all over the world all over the world the students are suffering from this type of problem if nine numbers are given to you nine consecutive numbers are given to you let us say the nine numbers are 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 and you are told to adjust these numbers in a square format this is your square format in this square format there are nine small boxes in a square form you have to set the nine numbers in such a way that the sum vertically the three vertical columns must be same as well as in the three horizontal rows must be same as well as diagonally the sums must be same now how we start to fulfill the m so let us see the starting from a small a let this be a small a a small b a small c you can also use capital alphabet no harm But you have to write in this way. A B C. After that D, E, F, G, H, and I. Let us see. A B C, A B C, D E F, G H I. So in this way, this is your. You have to move according to this direction. So start from A. The first one will be A. The, the mid one will be B. The last will be C. Likewise, D. Then E. Then F. Then G. Then H. Then I. So in this way, you have to fill the box. It is easy to follow the nine alphabetical in this order. Now, after filling this, remember the code. There is a mathematical code, Hertzig head. The name is Hertzig head. H E B M C I G and F A D. This is Hertzig head. M C I G. Hey, easy to remember. Hey, sig, hey, hey, sig, hey, hey, sig, hey will solve the purpose. So immediately, this is the solution square. Where the nine small black uh, squares, the nine small squares are to be filled with nine consecutive given numbers in such a way that the sum vertically, horizontally, and diagonally must be same. Now the value of h is four. See where is h? H is four. So this will be four. Now the value of e is five. Where is e? Five. So write five here. Then B, B is six. B here. So write here six. Then C is seven. Just C here seven, seven. Now I is eight. I is the central element. So this is eight. Then G is nine. So where is G? G is nine. So write nine. F F is ten. Here is ten. So write ten. A A is eleven. This is A eleven. And lastly, the D is twelve. So D is twelve. Now let us verify by adding whether our M is fulfilled or not. So let us add. 
11 and 6 17 17 plus 7 is 24 now see the second column 4 8 12 12 12 24 same sum 9 and 10 19 plus 5 is also 24 Likewise, horizontally 7 plus 12, 19 plus 5 is again 24. 6 plus 8, 14 plus 10 is again 24. And 11 plus 4 is 15 plus 9 is again 24. Now let us check diagonally. Diagonally 7 plus 8, 15, 15 plus 9 is again 24. So the diagonal sum is also this side, this way diagonal. Let us see this way. 11 plus 8, 19 plus 5 is 24. Now children, just see how we have started. Uh, the 9, 9 squares are given to you. Fill the squares with A, B, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I in this way. This is your arrow diagram to fill the 9 boxes. After that, write 9 consecutive numbers given to you. After that, write and seek head. This is your code of conduct. With the help of this code of conduct, you will be answering um, the, quest the question given to you. Now, H44, put the value of H4, H4, E5, E5, then B6, B6, here 6, then C7, C is 7, right 7, I is 8, I is 8, right 8, G is 9, right G 9, F 10, right F 10, and A is 11, A 11, right A 11, and lastly D is 12. The D is here, 12. Now check the vertical sum, horizontal sum, and diagonal sum, all are equal to our habit fulfilled. Thank you, students. Try to subscribe and like my channel, it's my, I am Sasibhusan Misra, the mathematics teacher, um, so thank you very much, okay, we will meet again later on, thank you, thank you, okay, bye.